hello everybody and welcome to my channel today we are going to take a look at the new undercover mode in kali linux 2020 so let me just go ahead and start kali linux right now uh full screen okay and now let me just go to exclusive mode okay so why do you need kali linux undercover mode to begin with so for example let's just say you are sitting on, in a public place you are in a bar or something and you open your kali linux like this so as you can see it looks like a really it have a let's just say hackers vibe to it so for example even if you do something like ip config i shouldn't do it because you will all know my ip but uh, something like that let's just go and say ls and you do cd slash downloads Come on, come on, I'm no hacker. Let me see, okay, CD downloads, go ahead and LS. And let me say if, uh, let me just say if you're, you're working on your Kali Linux, just like this, then people will start speculating. They will start thinking you're doing something shady. And you will have some problem, I guess. Like, this is not the most convenient way. So that's why Kali, by offensive security so basically offensive security included a new version known as the undercover mode in kali linux and we'll take a look at how to do it so by default if you load into kali the interface is genome okay so if you try to go ahead and do something like kali undercover it will give an error and say error undercover mode only works in xfc desktop and why is that it's because xfc desktop have things like a taskbar, have a start menu and other stuff similar to Windows 10 or other Windows platform. So that's why they prefer XFC. Don't worry, XFC is already in Kali Linux. All you need to do is, since you're already logged into Genome, all you need to do is just go here and simply log out. Once you log out, yes, of course, thank you, log me out. After you log out, you will be presented with, of course, your login screen. Come on. Okay, so here we are with our login screen. And now um, it will show all the usernames. So in this case, we only have one username. Once you click on it, here, as you can see, there is a little setting icon. You click on it and it will give you option for all your possible desktop environment so currently we use genome by default but for using the undercover mode as i already said you need to go to exit c click on exit c and then enter your super secure password excuse me i made a typo right there okay and once you enter your super secure and discreet password you will go directly into the exit c environment and it should load any second now so as you can see it's already in undercover mode actually i was doing um undercover so let me just go ahead and get rid of undercover mode okay so uh let me just make it okay so by default if you haven't used xfc undercover mode for like before this is what will be loaded so this is still looks more like Kali Linux and hacker stuff. So people will have their suspicions around you. And this is something you can't just rock. So all you need to do is you have two options. First of all, you can just open a terminal right here. And once you open the terminal, let me just go ahead uh, to view or where can I, where can I, okay, preferences and okay so here here it was so all we need to do is just let me just go ahead and quickly change this to 18 or something so that you can clearly see what is going on okay 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 so now you should be able to see what i'm typing right so you have two options the first one is you can just go ahead and simply type kali dash undercover and hit enter or you can go to the start menu of the xfc search for undercover 
and once you click on it you will go to the Kali undercover mode it takes some seconds and boom here we are it looks like a Windows machine so for example if you are using this no one will suspect you they'll be like yes this dude is like doing some regular Windows stuff which everyone do and this looks a little bit different of course because it's not it's not Windows 10 of course but as you can see this is much better like if you are using this in public then no one will suspect you you are doing something shady so this is definitely what Kali undercover mode is and once you are done with everything you are doing hopefully legal stuff only then you can just go ahead and type Kali dash undercover and it will revert back to your old exit scene so this was basically how you can do uh, how you can enable Kali undercover disable Kali undercover and do whatever you want while still being discreet and not gaining a lot of attention because this is the last thing you want to do when you are doing publicly so let me just go ahead and quickly shut it down if you like this video please leave a like also if you have any problem installing configuring or doing anything in Kali Linux or any other Ubuntu or maybe any other Linux environment any other operating system if you want to install Hackintosh let me know in the description down below I can help you I guess I can help you so also if you have some specific questions you can always join my discord link and the discord link will be of course in the description you can just go there ask me some question I will assist you and if the problem is really complex I will definitely make a video about it so leave a like on this video subscribe to the channel and as always thanks for watching until next time peace